Hello guys, another important video for PLAB2 chicken pox in pregnancy. We can divide this topic into risk to the fetus versus a risk to the mother. So first I, I'm going to discuss risks to the baby fetus. So if the mother catches chicken pox before 28th week of pregnancy, there is very small risk of fetal varicella syndrome. There is no treatment for fetal varicella syndrome and this can affect baby's skin, eyes, brain, limbs, bladder and bowel. But this risk is very rare. Now, if the mother catches chickenpox between 28th to 36th week of pregnancy, the virus is transmitted to the baby, but remains dormant. No treatment is required, and the baby may develop shingles during first few years of life. But if the mother catches chickenpox after 36th week of pregnancy, the baby may born with or without chickenpox. If baby borns without chickenpox rash at birth, then varicella zoster immunoglobulins are considered. But if baby is born with chickenpox rash, then we need to treat the baby with acyclovir. Important thing to remember is that if baby is exposed to someone with chickenpox within seven days of the birth, then we also need to give varicella zoster immunoglobulin because within these seven days, baby is not protected against chickenpox. Now coming to risks to the mother. If the mother catches chickenpox before 20th week of pregnancy, you only need to advise self-help measures, which are paracetamol, plenty of fluids, and over-the-counter cooling creams or gels. No treatment with acyclovir is needed unless mother is at high risk of developing complications. Risk factors are if mother is smoker or she has underlying lung conditions like bronchitis or emphysema or there is history of recent steroid use. In these cases, treatment with acyclovir may be considered. But if the mother catches chickenpox after 20th week, uh, weeks of pregnancy, then along with self-help measures, we need to give treatment with acyclovir, but acyclovir should be given within 24 hours of appearance of the chickenpox rash. Acyclovir cannot cure chickenpox, but can reduce the severity of the symptoms and risk of complication. Very important to remember that possible complications of chickenpox in high-risk mothers can be pneumonia, encephalitis, or hepatitis. So you need to do safety netting. You should advise to the mother that come to the hospital immediately in case of if you develop cough, chest pain, shortness of breath, headache, vomiting, if you feel sick, or if you develop severe rash or the rash which is bleeding or vaginal bleeding. So in these cases, come to the hospital immediately because she might need specialist care. So very, very important that check whether this patient has any risk factors and then consider giving acyclovir. Normally, acyclovir is given if mother catches chickenpox after 20th weeks of pregnancy. And that's the end of this video. Thank you very much.